Hey everybody, it's Four Eyes Gamer. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Minecraft. Last part, we went over there and we went crazy and started trying to live every day as if it was our last. And we and we got some iron armor and it, as you can see, we lost a bunch of it because I got shot by a bunch of skeletons. I suck at fighting skeletons. As you can see, we got three gunpowder over there. And, so yeah, so, oh look, there's, see that thing, I remember when that thing first got added into the game Minecraft, and I got scared, like I saw a bunch of those things in the, in the water, I thought they were giant spiders, but nope, they're just squid, they're passive mobs. But all they drop are ink sacks, which don't really do anything anyways, except for decoration. I don't care, I'm not like some kind of neat freak. I guess we could make a bow, the string we got here, but then... Oh, we need one more string, and also we need material to make arrows, because otherwise we don't... These arrows just... We don't really have enough to make it useful. Anyways. So here... If you do this, you can make some TNT. Oh yeah, on my Minecraft server, I actually, like, tried to do controlled demolition, sort of, with TNT to blow up someone's house. Anyways, so yeah, anyways, in the new... It used to be that TNT, that when you punch it, it activates. But now if you punch it, it just destroys it, so you pick it up. So to activate it, you need to set, either set on fire, which we don't have flint and steel, so we can't really do that. Or pressure plates or something like that. Redstone related stuff. But you know what? Actually, this isn't much redstone. But we actually don't need redstone for that. All we have to do is make a pressure plate and So, like, see, if I stand on that right now, that TNT's gonna ignite. I wonder if you can destroy primed TNT. I kind of hope not, because then, like, let's say if I s try to set off TNT in front of someone on multiplayer, and then they just destroy it and take it for their themselves. And I'd be like, what? Alright, damn, so we got some, a little TNT here. Let's save that for later, though. Um. <sighs> oh, wait. Well, let's just make some more torches. And. Anyway, let's make a bucket so we can get lava. Wait. Actually, a very smart thing to do is make two buckets. One for water and one for lava. The reason for this is, is to, as a fire extinguisher in case, like, you burn from the lava, so you don't burn to death. Because so otherwise, then, if you don't get water, you'll just keep burning until you die. Let's cook this. Alright, so. So, what you want to do... What you want to do is you get some iron, first of all, and let's see here, One, two, three, four, five, six, that's where you're going to do if we want to make six buckets, I mean two buckets, and you do like that, so one there, wait, let's put some cobblestone in, and one here. Where exactly should we put this one? Let's put it in the same spot as the pressure plate. You know what? Let's do this. We're not gonna... You, we're gonna save our TNT for later. You're probably like, For as gamer, you should put the TNT in the chest in case you die and lose one remember. 
remember, if I, just like I said before, if I die, the L, I consider the LP to be over. Because my life, because that basically means my life has ended. Anyways, so anyways, let's get some water. Some Wawa. And let's go get some lava over there. Lava really helps for killing monsters, especially creepers. You basically want to light them on, get them to light on fire, and then run away. Because otherwise, if you get close to it, then it has a chance of blowing itself up. Not only does that possibly make it so you get a little damage, but that also means that once it blows up, you don't get gunpowder. For some reason. Probably probably because it used its gunpowder to blow itself up, to be honest. I think I just heard the sound of some monster go... Uh, making retarded sounds. So it must be like some cave below or something, but I don't care about that. Plus, I think we already explored that cave anyways. Let's see here, so... What I want to do is... Get some of this lava. Great. So now this is a weapon, see? You do like this. Oh yeah, and it doesn't seem to like start forest fires or anything like that as much. It burns someone's house down. Down. If you if you're trying if you're trying to like set someone's house on fire or something in multiplayer or whatever, I recommend flint and steel. I don't know why. I'm trying to see show you guys that it doesn't seem to want to burn this tree down. Now, there it goes. But Oh, finally that tree's catching on fire. But yeah, it takes a long time. See, flint and steel, you can do it instantly. But yay, we set something on fire. That sounds pretty cool. Hey, we got some light then, that means. Oh, crap. You know what? It's night time. Do 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 That looks so cool. Oh yeah, and when you light a tree on fire and burn it, one of one of the pieces will always just stay and burn practically forever because just like when you make fireplaces on Minecraft, if you make fireplaces on Minecraft, it doesn't like completely destroy the block. So yeah. So it sort of assumes that you're making a fireplace. So I guess the one that you want on fire first doesn't burn away. I don't know. See there? That's gonna burn forever. Oh, never mind. It usually seems to do that. You know, I I don't know. I don't know that much about fire physics. I, I haven't even... To be honest, I haven't made something like... I haven't made... When my I haven't made a fireplace myself. Okay, so that's how you want to kill a creeper, is you just use that fly on fire. It takes a while to die though, but that's okay. You can finish it off with your sword if you like. See, we got some gunpowder now. 
But yeah, so unless you unless you find some kind of crazy way to like make some sort of underground mo mob trap or whatever, which I don't feel like doing, then then this is probably the easiest way to get gunpowder. It's like the spider on fire too. Yeah, nice. Oh no! Wow, it seems to be coming faster at me when it's when on fire. I didn't know that. I'm not sure if it actually did come faster, or if I'm just imagining it. Let's destroy this so we can get up. We have two gunpowder. And also we have a spare one at home, so... We have an extra one at home, so we need two more gunpowder, and then we can make another TNT. Yeah, burn you zombies. Zombies are like the easiest mob to kill. But the stuff you get for killing them is pretty much worthless. Just feathers. If I really wanted feathers, I'd 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 wait till the daytime and kill chickens. Feathers are good for making arrows. Okay, to make arrows you need feathers, sticks, and flint, which you get from gravel. But you need a lot of gravel to do it. Because there's like, there's like, like a small percent chance that destroying gravel will drop flint. But yeah, since we're trying to look, since our LP is almost over anyways, we're not going to bother with bows and arrows. Yeah, I just like, to, once those guys are on fire, I like to finish them off. Just finishes the job fast. Okay, we need one more gun tower. It's like I said before, we got an extra at home. Uh oh, no! Whoa, 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 whoa. That was close. Oh no, a creeper. Let's kill it. And like, oh yes, a creeper, because we want his gunpowder. So killing him yields nice rewards. Um. Where's that dead creeper? Oh, well, if he was dead... You wouldn't see his body, you'd see his gunpowder, and maybe he didn't drop gunpowder. Sometimes they don't drop anything. Because mobs in this game seem to either drop zero, one, or two of their items. Whoa. Yeah, string so far is only. The only practical uses are two things. Fishing rods, which nail you fish, so you can and get some fish to eat. Don't restore that much health anyways. Yeah, that's what a fishing rod is good for. You need string to make that. And the other is a bow and arrow. There's a skeleton over there and mobs that I don't care about. I only really care about killing creepers. Cause TNT, cause TNT's fun to use. It'd be even more fun on a PvP server. Or any survival multiplayer server, or such as mine. Even if PvP's off, you can still kill people. Yeah, that's right. But you can't like kill them with swords or anything, and you have to kill them indirectly, like with TNT or something, or so at least blow their house up or something. Um, so yeah. And once I actually killed someone, basically with flint and steel, I, I, I lit the ground that they were walking on on fire. Whoa! 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 whoa. Yeah, I lit the ground they were walking on on fire. 
and then they burn to death. You could, I guess you could also use lava too, but I didn't happen to have a of lava on. And if we go home and stuff off, we can make another TNT block. But, but, let's get some more anyways. Oh crap, I'm being shot at. I'm, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. You know what, let's get out of here. I don't care about that creeper right now. I care about, about my life. Um, see, I'm not by no means good at finding skeletons, as you guys can tell. Let's try to make it back to the Four Eyes Cave. I mean, the Four Eyes Island, or whatever. Or, you know what? Well, I think the night's almost over anyway. Uh oh, crap, this is not good, this is not good. So, if, if they're in the water, the skeletons aren't going to burn up. Let's, let's try to Crap, crap, my armor's gone. I don't have any, any more food. I'm so dead, I'm so dead. Crap, crap, crap. No, 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 I I cannot let those things get near me. I need to find pigs fast. To be somewhere where all the mobs will burn up. Skeletons are the worst because they because they can just shoot you from like a mile away or whatever. Hey, this is not good. This is not good. Yeah, that's the very least we can say. We're gonna die, maybe. Well, we're gonna end this LP soon anyways, right? Well, although the thing is, I kind of wanted to be able to use that TNT. Maybe we can just use that TNT to blow ourselves up and end this LP anyways. But no. That would be kind of dumb. I w let's go find some pigs and try to survive this. You know what? Why don't we go to the Four Eyes Island, where it's all safe and cozy and stuff. Use that string to make a fishing rod, and then, like I was talking about earlier, and, and then go fish for some fish and because it's after all it is an island it can't, it's not that hard to fish there you know it's pretty safe too and then fish don't restore that much health though so we'll need to catch a good bit of them and we'll just eat them and we'll c cook them too to make them restore a little bit more health although the first few ones we're getting we probably gonna eat right away because just in case cuz like like if pretty much anything bad happens that involves me losing health I'm so dead uh oh I think I'm lost or am I Which way is the four eyes? Let's go. Ooh, a pig. Let's kill it. I want your pork chops. Come here. Yes, he dropped two. Nice. These are raw, but we're desperate. We need to eat them right now. Alright, there we go. Let's go home. We can find him. You know, I think I don't know where we are actually. Let's try heading back. Well, at least I'll. I hope I won't. I hope nighttime doesn't come. If it does, I'm screwed.
That at least it's not like if the slightest thing happens, I'm totally dead. It's, I, it's just that if I come in contact with some mobs, I'm practically totally dead. Okay, whatever. Please. Oh yeah, I think we, we're, I think we're, wow, I'm such a noob, when I was over there I thought we were on the, on the continent that's right next to the Four Eyes Island, but apparently, I don't know, apparently we're still, we're still on the West, Four Eyes West continent. At least I think we are. Let's see. Ooh, a river. Cool. Sort of river. And what's cool though about the 1.8 update is there are actual rivers that go on for a good bit of time. Alright, maybe not as long as the Amazon River or anything, but still good. I think the world's starting to randomly j Uh oh, I'm totally lost. Oh wait. We don't have iron. If we had iron, I would use... I could use a bit of this red... I need four iron and just use one of these red stones. I can make a compass, which points towards your spawn point. Which would be my bed. Oh, nice. Let's kill these pigs. Yay, pork. Exactly what we need. Yay. Alright, so we are not dead. We are not totally dead anymore. But. We're lost. And that sucks. So next time on Let's Play Minecraft, we are going to go home. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. See you next time.